Welcome to the homework for lesson 30. It's module 4 of grade 2. Write your name here first. <clears throat> now we're looking at Carrie and Marty's work. They both solved 136 plus 56. Carrie used new groups below and Marty used totals below. Explain what's different about how Carrie and Marty solved the problem. Just look at it. And all you have to do is look at it and say what's different about it. Uh, we can say Carrie bundled ones to make tens, but Marty didn't, did he? Because here Carrie bundled ones to make a ten. But Marty didn't actually do that, did he? He just wrote twelve when he added six plus six. That's really the main difference. I think, because they're both adding 30 and 50 to get 80, except Marty's writing it as 80 instead of <coughs> adding the, the 1 and the 8. They're adding different numbers, but they're getting the same totals. So how do we say this? Let's say... that Carrie bundled 10 ones. to add digits, tens digits. Marty added using place value All right, next page. Here's one way to solve 145 plus 67. This would be new groups below. For A, solve this another way. So you can see this is 5 and 7 is 12. So here's the two ones, and that's the 10. So sometimes it's up here. Sometimes it's down here. Now they put it below instead of above, which is where a lot of us are used to seeing it. So let's add it another way. Really, almost any other way you want. I'm going to use totals below. 145 plus 67. The 7 and the 5, there's a 12. And the 40 and the 60 makes 100. And the 100 is just 100. 2 and 0 and 0 is 2. 1 and 0 and 0 is 1. And 2 ones adds up to 2, 212. <clears throat> How are these two different ways similar? Well, let's see. Right here. What are we doing in the tens place? Well, let's see. No, in the ones digits, we're still adding 5 plus 7 to make 12. So, for ones digits, both add 5 plus 7. And then for the tens digits, both add 4 plus the 6,
right? Because there's the 4, 6, and the 4 plus the 6. And then they add this 1 also, right? Plus 1. Except for here, it's a 1, it's a, it's a 10 and a 100, the way it's added here. <coughs> and then for here, for the 100s, it's still two ones added together. Now there's lots of other things. You don't have to write exactly what I wrote. There's lots of other things you can notice. Just whatever you notice. Whatever you notice that looks the same between the two ways. Just look at the numbers that you add and see which ones are the, how they're the same. All right, and then here we have uh, another way to solve 142 plus 39. And now this was totals below. So you know what? Here's another way to do it. I'm going to bring back, you guessed it, tape diagram edition, 142 and 39. Now, wouldn't this 39 be easier to add if it was just a 40? All right, so let's make it plus 1. Let's make it a 40. So now it's 40, but the, that one more to make it a 40 had to come from the 142. So now it's 141. And now this we can add. We can look at this and just add it. In our heads, 141 plus 40 equals 181.